Hey everyone, in this video what we're going to do is we're going to solve the following partial differential equation right here. u is a function of two variables, that is u is equal to u of x of t. We can also rewrite what we have right here is the partial of u with respect to x plus x multiplied by u is equal to zero. This is just alternative notation for this. So, for example, if we were taking the partial derivative of u with respect to t, we would have ut, and we can rewrite this as the partial of u with respect to t. So, that's all this notation here means. Anyway, let's solve our problem. What we're going to do is we're going to solve our PDE using an integrating factor. We're going to take our integrating factor to be e raised to the integral of x dx. Now, if we integrate this, we get e raised to x squared divided by 2. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to multiply our PDE by our integrating factor. If we do that, we get e raised to x squared divided by 2 times the partial derivative of u with respect to x plus x multiplied by e raised to x squared divided by 2 multiplied by u is equal to 0. Now, we can actually rewrite what we've got here using the product rule for partial derivatives. So if we do that, we have the partial derivative with respect to x of e raised to x squared divided by 2 times u is equal to 0. Now, if you're unsure of why this is, differentiate this using the product rule and you'll see that they're equal. Now what we're going to do is we're going to integrate our expression right here with respect to x. If we do that on the left hand side we're just left with e raised to x squared divided by 2 times u and this is equal to f of t. At this point all we need to do is divide by x raised to x squared divided by 2 and we get u is equal to f of t divided by e raised to x squared divided by 2 which can be rewritten as e raised to minus x squared divided by 2 times f of t. And this is the final answer to our problem. We can actually check that this solves our differential equation. All we need to do is calculate the partial derivative of u with respect to x and plug it into our PDE. So we have the partial derivative of u with respect to x is equal to minus x times e raised to minus x squared divided by 2 times f of t. If you remember, now if you remember, our original PDE was the partial derivative of u with respect to x plus x multiplied by u equals 0. So plugging in our expression for u in the partial derivative of u with respect to x, we get minus x e raised to minus x squared divided by 2 times f of t plus x multiplied by e raised to minus x squared divided by 2 f of t and this is equal to zero so we see that our solution here satisfies the partial differential equation thank you very much for watching if you found this content useful make sure to like and subscribe i hope you have a great day